begins with a simple question, a question that was posed on Twitter by a friend of mine. Does anybody have an idea for a collaborative poetry project? And so that question got me thinking, and I was wondering, could I help this person out? And so I immediately thought of one of my favorite apps on the iPad, Book Creator, and I thought, well, this might be kind of cool if we used uh, Book Creator to make an iBook of poetry. So I got back on Twitter, and I opened my big mouth, and I said, hey, I've got an idea. Let's do a collaborative poetry project. And uh, I wasn't even really sure if we could do it or not. And so before I realized what had happened, we had three teachers from three different states that decided to come together to write a poetry book with their students, second and third graders. And after a few months of work, this is what we came up with, the Collaborative Poetry Project. And so I loved it so much that I wondered what would happen if we took the world's children and we got them to collaborate together to create an iBook. And so, you know, I came up with this really cool idea and in my head, and I decided, you know, I'll go back to Twitter and I'll post it out there. And I wanted to know if there was any way that I could get one teacher from every country and every state in the world to collaborate to write a book. And so on Twitter, I posted this hashtag, Twima, which stands for The World Is My Audience. And I got some teachers involved. Uh, I didn't get the whole world like I had wanted, but we came close. And after eight months of work, we developed this, The World Is My Audience. 38 classrooms, 21 different countries, all writing poetry about where they lived. And so it was really interesting, a lot of fun. Uh, we've got some teachers from Saskatchewan. They love me for whatever reason. Um, I'm not even Canadian, I don't know. So uh, we've got some telegamis thrown in there. Uh, we've got lots of cool stuff. And so before this project had even you know, been live in the bookstore for a week, I've got people asking me, well, when are we gonna do the next one? And so I was like, okay. So I get back on Twitter, and I say, hey, why not? It's Tweema 2. And so we decided to do Tweema 2, but this time I wanted to step it up, and I wanted to make it even bigger. So after about four or five months of work, we came up with this, Tweema 2, Dreams Around the World. And in this book, we have 28 classrooms from 15 different countries, over 700 pages of writing and interactive media of our students' dreams, the good dreams, the bad dreams, the scary dreams. And so this book, again, was a ton of fun. It's now live in the bookstore, and we're having a, a good blast, you know, looking at all the downloads. And so now, the next project coming up, it's Twinga 3. Uh, it's coming up real soon. My good friend, Leah LaCrosse, is helping out with it. So we've had a couple questions already. I'll leave you with one last question uh, before we go, uh, and that is, who's in? Right? Thanks.